Hello my friends, ProHelp2010 with you today and welcome to my another Sony Vegas tutorial. Now I know I've made a tutorial previously in the grouping and ungrouping, but I've missed a big point that I try to make in that tutorial and just looking over that video, I realized that I should have done this and this is probably what many of you are probably looking for. So let's say you're working on a huge project and uh, you forgot to put something in the very beginning or you maybe forgot to put something in the middle of a clip. It would be a pain to have to move each clip one by one by one. So let me demonstrate to you what I'm talking about. Uh, let's say that each different section of this clip is a different video. And let me just uh, just kind of switch that up a little bit. And anyways, you get the point. Let's let's imagine this is all just a uh, different video. And let's say that I'm trying that I want to put something in between. Uh, let's say these two clips in between here I forgot to put something right here now for me to have to move everything shift everything to the left or to the right that would be to the right shift everything to the right one clip at a time it will really mess up everything uh, that, that you have just set in place so simply to fix that problem all you do is you just all you do is uh, oops let me just put that back it's really pissing me off is you press D on your keyboard and press it once more so you're gonna have like this little uh, I don't know it's like a little rectangle now that this allows you to select your clips like 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 so so uh, let's so we're gonna select anything uh, everything past this thing right here so we're gonna select everything here right click go to group and create new or press G on your keyboard and after you've done that now you're, you shouldn't be you could press D back and D once more to get it back to the way it was before and now you can shift the whole entire thing uh, without having to do it one by one and you could put something here in the middle uh, I don't know just put it there and you don't have to worry about messing everything up past that point so let me just quickly go over over this again all you're basically doing is you're do using a different uh, selection tool uh, which is press D and D again until you get this rectangle box select all your objects that you want to group together right click go to group and create new and it's going to create a group for that for that uh, for those objects that you have selected for those videos and to get it back press D two more times and you should get a normal cursor back so hope this tutorial was of some sort of help to you guys um, I haven't made tutorials in a while I'm sorry I'm, I've been pretty busy lately but I will get back to you uh, next time. So thank you guys for watching. Rate, comment, subscribe. And I'll see you guys next time.